As we are exploring the way of giving, we wanted to share a gift to say thank you for continuing to move through this learning journey with us. The dynamic spin release is a technique I learned from an amazing man called Tim Halbom. It is a psychological process that helps reframe negative thoughts and feelings, turning them into more positive ones. Throughout my late 20s and early 30s, I suffered from depression, and this technique saved me many times from spiralling down into very dark places indeed. It's not just a tool to combat depression, it can be used for many different purposes. And we want you to have it, so use it wisely. Again, this technique relies heavily on taking notice. Once we become aware of negative thoughts, feelings, emotions, we have the responsibility to change them. We have the ability to manage ourselves and manage our mindset. So if you find yourself becoming aware of a negative emotion, visceral experience, or even physical pain, then follow this seven step process. Step one, locate it. Where are you representing this experience? Where is it located in your body? Is it in the head, the heart, the stomach, arms, legs? Where does it live? Unlock your somatic mind and locate where this negativity is. Step two, disassociate yourself from it. Throw this experience out in the distance and then throw it twice as far away again. Get some distance from this negativity. Disassociate yourself from it. Step three, what is it? Try and describe it, picture it. What does it look like, sound like? Is it light or heavy? Is there any texture to it? What color might it be? What is it like? Step four, spin it out. Ask yourself, if it was spinning, which way would it spin? Imagine it spinning and then spin it in the opposite direction and spin it so fast that it evaporates into thin air. Step five, reframe it. Go to the creative part of your brain and ask your imagination to come up with a metaphorical gift that is going to help you think and feel differently. Come up with a positive image, whatever that is, just trust it. Step six, send it out. Send this representation image out into the universe. Send it around the world, then call it back. And when it comes back, we want something else added to this image, something new. Again, allow your imagination to come up with something new that is an addition. Step seven, replace it. Now put this image with its addition back where the original experience was located. And there you have it. A nifty little technique to help you reframe your thinking and feelings. Make sure you learn it, pass it on, because it really does help.